Hello, one and all. Well, I'm back today with another video on my Mini. At last, I'm actually getting to work on my own car. Um, me and Jordan have been quite busy. We've been uh, welding up this recovery truck. Um, that's been pretty much it. Uh, we're still not done with it. it it's, it's very rusty, to say the least. So we've got a lot of stuff to do on it. And still going, but as you can see from today's title, back on the Mini. Um, this is actually being filmed the night before I'm working on my Mini because I'm just doing a little bit of prep work to uh, get stuff ready for tomorrow to work on my Mini. So I've got a few things to do. Um, I've got the driver's side front hub I need to change. And I've also got all the pulleys on the engine to change and also some switches in my control box for the hydraulics. So this is going to be the start of the pulleys. Let me just uh, flip the camera around and show you what I can see. So, in the old sandblasting cabinet, I've got some pulleys. Now, I've already sandblasted this one, but I've got the water pump pulley, and inside that water pump pulley, actually, let me just uh, open the side of the cabinet, and inside there, there's another alternator pulley which is the same as that one and of course the crank pulley so let me just get that one i've already sandblasted out and show you a bit better where's a bit of light that's a bit better so there we go that's all uh, looking rather new again so like i say i'm just going to do these three pulleys um yeah, I'll see if I can film some of it. That'll be uh, a little bit more interesting than me just uh, putting you down and picking you back up again when I'm done. So hold on, let me shut the door on there. Let's see if... Because it's there, very therapeutic, this sandblasting. Get a bit nearer to the camera, there you go. Look at that, why the rust just falls off of it. Lovely. Look at that. That's great. I love it. It's, uh, like I say, very therapeutic. Take things back to bare metal absolutely lovely so let me get my hands out of these gloves again and now i really am going to stop the filming and show you once it's all done right so these are almost ready for tomorrow now um i think that was the most satisfying one to do it's come out really well um yeah really pleased with that so, only thing is, I don't know if you can tell how dusty it is in here now. It's like a definite, definite sort of smog going on in the garage. You can see in that light, look. <laughs> it's so, it makes so much mess, that thing. So, anyway, so now, just going to give them a quick dust in a black paint. And that's it. Go indoors, ready to be up early tomorrow and get cracking with a mini. Woo! And there you go. Literally a dusting of satin black. I will go a bit more satin than that. By the time it's all dried. But yeah, that's that. That's all they need to look like. Just a dusting of that stuff. So there we go. So until a few nanoseconds time when it's then tomorrow morning. And I start this video again. Back in a minute. And here we are. The next day. Minnie's in the garage. Got Jordan around there moving the recovery truck. And Jordan's glanzer. And yeah, I got the t-shirt on today. Yeah, baby. <laughs> so anyway, there's my pulleys all ready to go on. But we got to fix some other stuff first because it absolutely stunk of petrol on the way around here. And... Let me flip the camera around and show you under the bonnet. You can see, but it really stinks. Oh, look, it's taken all the uh, undersill off the bulkhead. 
but this pipe is leaking. So, got to fix that first. Ow! Bang the head. Yeah. So, right, here we go. What we'll do first, fix the fuel leak first. I had to pump a tire up as well, because that was completely flat. It's a proper barn find now, look. <laughs> right, let's change this bit of pipe and then uh, get on to the real stuff. Radiator's out, fan off. And there's that end of the engine. Now, that's the reason I'm changing it over to a multi-rib belt. That's been on there, I would hazard a guess at less than 50 miles. So, got to get all these pulleys changed over for the different ones. And fingers crossed that will solve my problems. Who knows? Let's hope so. It's making a mess. It's making a mess. I am making a mess. It's bloody coolant everywhere. And I've tried to catch it, but it didn't work. Catch it? Catch it, yep. But you're making a mess too. Well, I've got cardboard. Yeah, but it's still a mess. It's good, this. Right. Next step, um, I think I've got to disconnect the engine mount and lift the engine up to get the crank bolt undone. So I'm gonna swap the crank pulley over. Oh. Um, yeah, is it up there next to the Jack Day JD bottle? That's where it'll be if it is up there. If it's not, it'll be in the rack with the rest of the paints. I might have put it over there. Uh, opted for KFC, I think. I knew you were going to say that. Why? Because I always struggle when you say KFC. You always struggle? Yeah. Why? Because I can't get drinks back. And that's why I'm going to come with me and I doubt anyone is going to want to come with me. I'll ask you. Yeah. Honda. That's it, Honda. Sating. Yeah, so... Jordan's got some money for you. So how much are we have in each at that job? 15 quid? Yeah, 20 quid. 20 quid? Yeah. Okay. So I'll have um, two Zinger meals, please. Okay. You've got 20 quid. So there's my 20 quid for two Zinger meals. Change, please. So I've got to do it separately? Well, I just want some change. Yeah, I've got to do it separately. Okay. And then, there's 20 quid. Mm -hmm. Um, you're a monster, Joe. You're always fucking right. Ah, you fucker! Fuck you! Fuck you! It's off! Fuck you! Yeah, the new one's bigger. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Put it next side by side. Nah, it's easy. No, taller. This no, it doesn't matter. No, yeah, that's it. A little bit. Let's see. Oh, fucking hate him. <laughs> I'll probably have to talk Abby or P or Hayley into coming with. If I do, can they have something as well? Mm -hmm. If I talk them into it. They're not mine, they're kids, so. <laughs> that is true. Well, yeah, that's fine. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, I, I, I only need Ah, no, fuck container. off. That's your girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> I still fucking hate him. <laughs> Good 
good. That's good. I'm happy. Um, personally speaking, I would leave it alone. Because and my reasoning behind that is, if there was loads of crap in yeah. the oil, yeah. then yes, I'd want to look further. But the simple fact is, there's no crap in the oil, yeah. so leave it the fuck alone. Yeah. Right, now could you stand on the brakes again for me? Let me tighten my nuts up. Yeah, yeah it's no point. No, no point. I think what's in there is your leftover. Yeah, because well, we couldn't clean it right out last time. We cleaned as much as we could out of the sump. Yeah. But that's when it ended. You know, we yeah. could, you couldn't go any further with it. And I mean, hold my hand up. I've given it a boot. Yeah. And it hasn't shut itself. Are you in? all the uh, pulleys and everything on so freshly filled up with coolant on to the next thing what's the next thing up 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 switches ah switches get bitches they do oh is it Range. Yeah, it's good. The um, Starlet pages, they recommend trying to keep the OEM water pump for about 150,000 miles. So now under the bonnet's done, kind of, just need a belt. I'm going to turn my attention to this. Um, this needs new switches because some of them work, some of them don't. So to change them I've got six brand new switches which I've just got to get in there so I've got to take that apart looking like all uh, right hold on I'll have a look on my phone at uh, auto data once I get this thing apart
Has it really? Right, soldering these wires on the back of here now. I know it's not very neat, but it's practical. It'll work. So, just a few more to go. I've got that as a uh, guide of where they all go, because I just cut it straight off. And there we go, that's the wire that goes to the car. Woo, let's get these done. Right, that's it for today. Have my little switch box now all back together and it works. So that's all good. Jordan's still poncing around with the uh, little black Japanese girl. <laughs> yeah. Um, and that's it. Yeah, away we go until next time. Um, I don't know what I'm going to be doing next time or how long the next time will be but uh yes join us uh again soon oh and uh alex hart alex hart alex hart oh we're facebooking facebooking it's all lies don't believe he's filming a video <gasps> how could he say that how could he say that Jesus God, Christ. look this is a video this is a video and look there's a tripod there there's jordan has also been videoing. I tell you what, what we're gonna do, we're gonna see this, right? Okay. Right, a little behind the scenes. So there's, there's a camera, there's Paul, Ooh. there's me. <clears throat> so we've got the cam covers all back on, they're all talked up. Well, we don't need to talk those up, do we now? But the cam covers are all back together. Woo -woo! Belts on. And, uh, well, I've got to put the bottom pulley on first before I can put the belts on. What a silly sausage I am. What a silly sausage. But anyway, I'm going to uh, put the bottom pulley on and I will catch you up in a bit. Not doing a video of my fucking arse. See, saw it here first. Saw it here first. His arse. His arse. <laughs>